Hello and welcome. Today I'll be installing Ubuntu, uh, the latest version, it's, it's 20.04, uh, and they will customize it. I will make it look uh, really, really cool, I think, uh, better than what shipped with. Okay, so let's start by just going straight to install. Select your language, if it was not selected by default. Here you can basically choose to install everything, uh, like software, office, games and stuff. I will not do that, I will just go with the minimum. But feel free to do that. You can select third party software, like graphic card, Wi-Fi and stuff you need to. For me I'm not, I'm not going to do anything. I'm just I would like to download the updates while installing and let's continue okay so I'm gonna just erase the disk and, and install everything on it so I have one disk and I'm gonna just use it as for testing purposes otherwise you can actually install elsewhere and then customize it but this is for me is, is good here it's give you a summary of what's gonna be done to your desk. So I'm gonna just continue. You select your location if it wasn't detected automatically, then continue. And here you can basically create your username, just typical name for, for your computer. I'll just be going through the slideshow uh, one by one. And after I finish it, I will pause the video and then wait for the installation to finish. Okay, um, so the first slide. I'll give you a second to pause the video if you want and then read on your own time. Okay, that's it. So I will post the, the video now and be back later when the installation is done. Welcome back. The installation is finished. Okay, I'll restart the computer right now and be back in a sec. Welcome back. Uh, the computer is restarted. Uh, we we have the welcome screen. Uh, basically, they want you to use cloud account, like login. I'm not going to use any of that, but feel free to use it. Let's skip for now. And DC, would you like to uh, now? Thanks. Okay. Send system information to Chronicle. No, thank you. Okay, allow application to determine it now. Thanks. It's off by default. That's good. Okay, in this section, what I'm going to do, I'm going to just uh, customize the desktop so it doesn't look as this, as ugly as this. Okay, so we can see you are ready to go okay so we just press done so i say use the minimum so i don't i'm gonna just uh let me say update software i'm gonna just run the command line to update it but feel free to, feel free to update from here if you want but for me i'm gonna just upgrade and and using terminal hopefully it's a press the window key I'm gonna just search for terminal then press enter first thing I will do I'm gonna just basically update and upgrade the system that's the first thing I do when I install any computer I need to use sudo okay and then yes to everything else Okay, while this one is doing that, I'm gonna just uh, 
see App Store or Snap Store or whatever. Uh, I need just to download the Twig tools from it uh, since I installed the minimum for some reason. I don't know. Okay, let me see if uh, okay this one's updated. You know what I'm talking about. Okay, um, let me see. This is the store. I'm gonna search for Twig tools for tweaks okay i'm interested in genome tweaks okay i think that's all i need to install from here basically it's not gonna take you far if you if you look for for tweak you'll see and you can change the template. Um, I personally like a different template. This one right here. But I'm gonna just leave it as default for now. So I'm gonna just close this for now. As you can see, if you go to extensions, it comes with these three extensions. But this is not gonna do much to us. So. Uh, or, or I need I need the dash to panel so in order to, to download dash to panel you, you can't basically download this from the store because it's not there I look and feel free to look to download dash to panel you need to go to GNOME extension store or website okay basically I'm gonna just look for a dash to panel gnome and it should take me to extensions and then as you can see you can install extension to chrome add okay and then you see this foot right here yeah, the problem is the the shell is not installed. I need to install that uh, gnome shell to be able to do that. Okay, what you need to do is to do sudo apt get install, and then you need to put chrome uh, genome. I think it's purge that shell. Okay, I think that's all I need from from here. Let's see now. I need to to refresh. Okay, we can get good. I'm gonna look for a dash to panel. Okay, here we go. Now you can just start from here. Start. As you can see, it's really really fast it's already we already made pro, uh, progress see we already have a nice windows like uh, menu but we can do better than that okay let's look for uh, I'll come back later to tweaks let me go back to extension and then now I need I need arc menu this is the only two extension I really like. Okay, so that's all we need from Chrome. We'll close everything. Okay, uh, now we need to to just basically uh, change. Let me first change the background change background feel free to, to use your own wallpapers let me see how this thing look mm, doesn't look bad okay we'll just leave it like that for now let me just close this we just 
they don't like things out of focus. Um, so let me just change it probably to something else. Mm, let me try this one. Okay, this one looks better, I think. Okay, the second thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go arc menu, I'm gonna look for tweaks. And then from tweaks, I will go to extensions. And then you can see now these two added. This is what I need. Uh, the first thing I will do, I'm gonna just a little bit um, give this one uh, some opacity a little bit not too much I'll just use default let me just turn in okay this looks good uh, second thing I'm gonna do I'm gonna just change the icon on on this arc menu uh, the default doesn't look that's, that's impressive okay so go to gear icon and let's see go to appearance arc menu icon yeah, i think it's this one then here we can choose uh, some icons uh, i personally like this one I like this one and they usually give it 32. okay okay well it wasn't that much really we didn't spend much time making it look like this it was fast and um, i think it looks awesome like this this is how you customize the desktop i hope you like this video and if you do make sure to press that like button and if you want to share this with your friends that would be awesome and if you want more videos like this please subscribe and uh, make sure to hit that bell icon so when i upload the videos you'll be notified uh, thanks again have a nice day